Hello, and welcome back to Coin Lady Channel. We've got some exciting news to share. I hope to speedily reach everyone with this message. If you enjoy these updates and discussions about XRP and Exelon Digital Assets, all I ask is that you hit the like button below to let us know, and please spread the word to allow the rest of the world in on the truth. While this rapid-fire output from XRP is currently at or above 65%, at the time of this recording, it was a whopping 6.5% and rising quickly. Then we've also got an Axon Lim Stellar looming performing fairly well up around 2.5% on the day respectively, sitting well above 12 cents. What has recently occurred, however, is not merely an institutional sale or X excuse it, which we will discuss in a moment. However, XRP and similar cryptocurrencies are seeing institutional buying of over $1 billion only this morning and consistently. But there are rumors flying around as of 14 minutes ago, relative to the time of this recording, that a legal expert believes may cause a ripple effect that will reduce the $770 million SEC punishment. Many of you in the XRP community, as well as the XL installer Lumen Fami, and, will be familiar with Jeremy Hogan and his unique perspective. Once more, speculation is rampant. As we approach the date of November 9th, when a potential settlement is expected to be reached, anticipation is rising. Hogan now notes that the SEC's goal was to recoup funds gained dishonestly. And it ought to be based on dividends, or net earnings, rather than the gross sum. As a result, the distinction is vital, since it enables businesses to deduct business costs, which could reduce the total amount owed. Last, but not least, Hogan says he wants to include a nexus question that might further limit the extent of financial penalties and that only sales within the U.S. fall within the SEC's jurisdiction. What he's suggesting is that the SEC shouldn't have to pay a fine unless wrongdoing occurred within its borders. We may be witnessing a reduction in the amount of the settlement that will be paid to the SEC, which is great news for the market as a whole and for specific cryptocurrencies like Ripple. However, if they can reduce the amount of money they have to pay to the SEC, they will be better able to continue doing what they have been doing, which is expanding their ecosystem through partnerships and the like. That is all I have for you at the moment. Tell me what you think about this. And don't forget the feedback space below. Put down the blades. Send the link along to let people know what's going on. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video, bye.